What's up, Flomies? This is Jesse Hart of Full Circle Phenomenal, here representing the Sacred Flow Art Channel. Today I'm on top of Pico de Loro, which translates to Beak of the Parrot. I'll show you why through a picture. And I'd like to show you the spiral wrap. What you want to do is, facing forward, turn 90 degrees to either side and get your poise spinning forward split time. Now granted, you may want to practice with just one poise spinning at a time, but I'm going to show you both at the same time. During a split time, you're going to bring your back hand forward and bring the hand that's already forward on top of the other hand, like so going for getting the tethers to wrap around your wrists or hands. And it's okay however they fall, just as long as you're starting to train your mind not to let them fly over your fingertips. So again, split time to one side, come forward, plop one hand on top, wrap, 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 and get as close to that as you possibly can. To get the full spiral wrap, you'll get the tethers to wrap all the way around your hands and then with your wrists do a little bit of a snap back action in, or, in order to bounce the poi off of your hands and or wrists get them going in the opposite direction and out. You might also once you're getting more used to it is separate your hands a little bit away from each other which can be easier to kick the poi back in the opposite direction. As I said before, if it's difficult for you, try just one poi. Get a wrap around the other wrist, and then maybe tilt your wrist and kick back in the opposite direction. Then with the other poi. Be sure to go in both directions. This time I'm going to get my back hand on top of the forward poi. both ways. Try going from a reverse three beat weave to a reverse three beat weave. That's all for today. Please like and subscribe to the Sacred Flow Art channel and keep coming back for more tutorials. If you'd like to check out more of this area, which is in southeastern Mexico, very close to the Guatemalan border, check out windkin.com for some tours and a visit to their sanctuary as well. See you guys next time.